everybody, today I will be showing you how to download free music onto your iPod, iPhone, iPad, any device like that. Um, so, let's get started. Open up your Google Chrome, your Firefox, or your Safari, whatever you have. I actually recommend Google Chrome because it's much better. Oh, um, did I, forget to, I forgot to mention we will be using iTunes for this. So it's called a mini.net. Do not type in www.amini.com because if you do, it will take you here. And this is not the site. This will not help you with anything unless you know what this is. And I'm not going to get into that. But you can type in www.amini.net. This is the correct website this will come up or if you want to make sure you get it right you can type in www.view.amini.net or .com I think either one works let me just check yeah it works okay so here we go in the search bar type in um what song I will show you which ones I have. I have all of these. And let's see, since I can't really think of a song right now, well, I'll just do one that I already have. It's called Mirrors by Justin Timberlake. <clears throat> Sorry, I feel like I'm losing my voice by the way I'm talking. <clears throat> okay, so type in right here. And uh, you just click one. I'll take you here and listen to the song. Okay, so I think most people are familiar with this song. Um, so I'm gonna, in a while, once it's in my iTunes or whatever, I'm going to show you that the song actually works. Because I know some people's like, oh yeah, when it downloads, it's just a piece of crap and it's not gonna work. It's just a picture to have on your screen. Well, it's not. I'm gonna show you that it works in just a second. So you see we're on the bottom where it says free download here, right under it, it says mirrors, Justin Timberlake, that mp3, right there. Click on that and it'll start downloading right under. You can exit out, we don't need that anymore. Um, oh, you can have, you can just download these regular or if you want to, you can have an account and put stuff on your playlist or wish list or whatever. And I'm actually signed in right now, so there's no need to sign out and show you again. Um, let's just wait for this to finish downloading. Okay, now that that's done, open it, and you're going to hear it in the iTunes. And once I click open, it's going to show iTunes. And, all right. Let's see again. There you go. Alright, now, unless you're going to add more songs, you can just close this. I like to save them, but I don't have to because I already have it right here. Let's see. Okay, so now I'm going to show you what to do when you're going to connect it to one of your devices. I have an iPhone 4S, which I'm going to connect right now, and something should pop up. Hmm, let's see. Okay, so I guess it didn't pop up this time. It's supposed to. Or maybe, wait, let me, I'm gonna disconnect it. Alright. I am. Okay, I'm gonna quit it anyways. So now, open up iTunes again. Just give that a second. Copying to my desktop. <coughs> <coughs> All right, now that that's done, open up your iTunes, and I'm going to connect my iPhone. See if it works this time. It probably won't because I've done. I already did it. Oh look, see it's right here. Didn't see that the first time. See. Okay, so it's, it's connected, 
go back to the music. Click on Justin Timberlake. These are every. This is everything that you wanna add in it. Um, okay, and now press done. Apply. That's not really my name. I just put that there for show. Um. Okay. Now that I have the song in there, it's it's safe to eject your phone. Okay. And now I'm unlocking it. And there you go. So now that the song is in my phone, you can. I will play it from my phone. Just give me one second. Gotta unlock. Okay. Go to my music. It should be here now. Uh, just a timber. Okay, right here. And there you go. If you could hear it, that was it was playing from my phone. Well, now I have two Justin Timberlake songs of the same one, but that's all right. So I hope this helped. And okay, bye. I hope this helped you a lot.